Once upon a time, in a bustling city filled with noise, chaos, and constant movement, there lived a man named Ethan. Ethan was a successful businessman, always rushing from one meeting to another, constantly chasing after the next big opportunity. He believed that success could only be achieved through nonstop action and busyness. One day, as Ethan was hurrying through the streets, his attention was caught by a street performer. The performer, dressed in simple robes, sat cross-legged on the ground, playing a haunting melody on a flute. Ethan paused for a moment, captivated by the enchanting music that seemed to fill the air. Curiosity stirred within him, and Ethan approached the street performer. How do you create such beautiful music? he asked, his voice filled with awe. The street performer smiled gently and replied, I create music not by playing every note, but by embracing the spaces in between. It is in the silence that the true beauty of the music resides. Intrigued by his words, Ethan sat down beside the street performer, eager to learn more about the power of stillness. The street performer shared a story, a story that would forever change Ethan's perspective. Imagine, the street performer began, a beautiful garden filled with a variety of flowers. Each flower blooms in its own time, revealing its unique colors and fragrance. Now, imagine if all the flowers bloomed at once, competing for attention and overshadowing one another. The beauty and serenity of the garden would be lost. Ethan envisioned the chaotic scene in his mind and nodded in understanding. The garden, continued the street performer, is a metaphor for life. Just as the flowers need time to bloom and unfold their beauty, we too need moments of stillness to cultivate our own inner growth. In the stillness, we find clarity, insight, and a deeper connection with ourselves and the world around us. Ethan was struck by the street performer's words. He realized that he had been so consumed by his fast-paced lifestyle that he had forgotten the importance of stillness. He had neglected the spaces in between the moments of quiet contemplation and self-reflection that could lead to a more meaningful and balanced existence. Inspired by the street performer's wisdom, Ethan embarked on a journey of embracing stillness in his life. He made a commitment to incorporate moments of silence and solitude into his daily routine. He started each morning with meditation, allowing his mind to settle and his thoughts to flow freely. During his busy workday, he took short breaks to step outside, feeling the gentle caress of the wind on his face, and simply breathing. In the midst of his newfound stillness, Ethan began to notice a profound transformation within himself. He became more attuned to his own needs, desires, and values. He discovered a deep well of creativity and inspiration that had long been overshadowed by the constant noise and distractions of his busy life. Furthermore, Ethan found that embracing stillness allowed him to be more present in his interactions with others. He listened more attentively, allowing space for deeper connections and meaningful conversations. He realized that the quality of his relationships improved as he offered his full presence and undivided attention to those he cared about. As word of Ethan's transformation spread, his colleagues and friends became intrigued. They marveled at his newfound calmness and clarity amidst the chaos of their shared world. They sought his guidance, eager to understand the secret behind his inner transformation. Ethan shared the story of the street performer and the metaphor of the blooming garden, inviting others to explore the power of stillness in their own lives. He challenged them to consider how their relentless pursuit of constant activity might be hindering their personal growth and overall well-being. In a society that values productivity and constant busyness, Ethan's message was thought-provoking. He encouraged people to pause, to create space in their lives, and to find solace in stillness. He urged them to reflect on the spaces in between their actions and to embrace the beauty and power that lies within those moments. Ethan's thought-provoking example came in the form of a simple experiment. He gathered a group of people in a room and asked them to participate in a collective exercise. Each person was given a blank canvas and an assortment of vibrant colors. The task was to create a painting that represented their lives, using the colors to depict their experiences, emotions, and aspirations. 
as the participants eagerly painted, the room filled with a flurry of activity. Everyone was focused on applying colors to their canvases, trying to cover as much surface area as possible. The atmosphere was charged with energy, but something felt amiss. After a while, Ethan interrupted the frenzy and asked the group to stop painting. The room fell into an expectant silence. Ethan invited the participants to take a step back and observe their paintings. What they saw left them perplexed. The canvases were filled with vibrant colors, but there was a lack of cohesion, a sense of disjointedness. The paintings appeared chaotic and overwhelming. It was evident that in their eagerness to fill every inch of the canvas, the participants had neglected to consider the importance of negative space, the stillness and emptiness that provides balance and harmony. Ethan used this powerful visual representation to spark a conversation about the power of stillness in our lives. He urged the participants to reconsider their approach to their art and to life itself. He challenged them to embrace the spaces in between, to allow for pauses, reflection, and simplicity. He emphasized that the power of stillness lies not in the absence of action, but in the intentional creation of balance between activity and silence. The impact of Ethan's experiment was profound. The participants realized that their constant pursuit of filling every moment with action had left them feeling overwhelmed, disconnected, and unfulfilled. They recognized the importance of cultivating stillness as a means of finding clarity, regaining balance, and nurturing their inner selves. Ethan's thought-provoking example resonated far beyond that room. As the participants shared their experiences with others, a ripple effect began to take hold. People from all walks of life started to question their own relationship with stillness and the role it played in their well-being. In a world dominated by social media, notifications, and the constant pressure to be productive, the moral lesson of the power of stillness became a profound wake-up call. It challenged individuals to find moments of quiet amidst the noise, to prioritize self-care and introspection, and to seek a deeper connection with themselves and others. As the movement grew, people began integrating stillness practices into their daily routines. They took time for meditation, mindful walks in nature, and moments of reflection. They discovered that in the spaces between their actions, they found clarity, inspiration, and a renewed sense of purpose. The metaphor of the blooming garden and Ethan's thought-provoking experiment served as powerful reminders that stillness is not a luxury, but a necessity in our fast-paced world. It is the key to cultivating inner peace, fostering authentic connections, and living a more intentional and meaningful life. So, as you navigate the complexities of modern life, remember the power of stillness. Embrace the spaces in between and allow yourself moments of silence and reflection. In doing so, you will discover a profound sense of balance, clarity, and fulfillment. You will find that true strength lies not in constant activity, but in the intentional cultivation of stillness within. Thanks for joining us on this incredible journey. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. And remember, life is an adventure, so keep exploring, stay curious, and never stop chasing your dreams. Until next time, stay tuned for more epic stories. This is Keepers of Inspiration. Inspiring you, one story at a time.